Numbers 21, 30 through 32. Numbers 21, 30, 31, and 32. Okay, we have shot them down. Hashbron has perished as far as Gibbon. And we have laid them wait east as far as Namphium that reaches Magdium. So they conquered this land of Moab. The fact is, Moab wasn't a promised land. This was just a casualty on their way to God's promise. God's going to bless us along the way to receive his blessing. Many people look at this world and be like, oh, I'm blessed. I'm blessed. We don't need to settle for half the blessing. Because the full reward is what he wants to give us. And sometimes we settle. I don't think they're settling here, but that's what I can get out of this. And we'd like to share. We don't need to settle because we have a victory. Because God wants us to carry it to the, us on to the next victory. The victory we need to go to. The victory he's been leading us to. The small battles. While the victories are sweet. He plans so much more for us. If we just keep letting him lead. <coughs> <coughs> okay, verse 31. Thus Israel dwelt in the land of the Amorites, so they conquered the Amorite territory. Um, mentioned Moab, though. Okay, so that's what confused me in the earlier part. Moses sent the spot out Jazer. They took its villages and disposed of the Amorites who were there. So they did, unlike what Israel did once they got to the promised land, they did what they were supposed to. The people that, that were there, they cleared it out. They either killed them or they had to move on. Israel was supposed to do this in the promised land. But many times they failed to do it. You know, it seems like it's easy to do what it we're supposed to when it ain't necessarily what we're supposed to do to it to the small blessings but when it's in the big blessings we try to settle we try not to do the full thing because by the end it's like well uh, but that causes us to miss out on the blessings we're to drive even more once we get there than we did when we got there the, uh, drive even more than what got us there. We're to put as much, if more, effort into it. God's blessing. He's will for us.